Ubiquinol versus Ubiquinon. What's the difference when it comes to absorption? There are many myths about the absorption of coenzyme Q10 and which form is better. Ubiquinol, also known as QH, or Ubiquinon, also known as CoQ10. Let's see what actually happens in the body when you take a Ubiquinol capsule. On the left, we can see that the whole column is violet. This means that the entire capsule content at this time is Ubiquinol. As the capsule passes through the small intestine, the color changes from violet to orange. It shows that the Ubiquinol is being oxidized and thereby converted to Ubiquinol. When passing from the intestine to the body's lymphatic vessels, the capsule content is almost 100% in the form of ubiquinol. On the five-hour journey up through the body's lymphatic vessels, the ubiquinon switches back to ubiquinol, and we see the column change back to violet. From the lymph, the ubiquinol is emptied into the blood, still predominantly as ubiquinol. As we can see, the ubiquinol is changing form twice during the absorption process. On the other hand, when we take a ubiquinon capsule, we see the whole column starts out orange because the entire capsule's content is ubiquinon. We see the orange color is preserved during the passage in the small intestine. All the capsule content remains in the ubiquinon form when passing from the intestine to the body's lymphatic vessels. Only on the way up through the body's lymphatic vessels does the ubiquinon convert into ubiquinol, as illustrated by the column changing to violet. So as we see, when taking ubiquinon instead of ubiquinol, we save the body for one conversion. At Pharma Nord, we produce both forms, but we recommend ubiquinon. Less, more, better. Less expensive, more stable, better documentation. Ubiquinon, why pay more for less?